Will Antonio Brown really play? That has been the question for the past week leading up to tonight's Empire game, and we have the answer for you. Sports Director Roger Wyland is live at MVP Arena and joins us now. Raj, how are you doing? Uh, <laughs> I'm great. Uh, Ashley, I said all week this and for the last month, really, a couple of months, this story is exhausting. Here's the latest layer. Yes, Antonio Brown has said all along that he would play tonight in front of what will be 5,000 fans at MVP Arena. Bottom line is he will not play tonight. I don't even know he's in the building right now, but he will not play because they say, Pete Porcelli told me a little bit earlier in our newscast that the paperwork related to his physical did not go through in time. And that's the reason that he's not playing tonight. He's on the 25 man roster, but not on the 21 man roster, which is the active roster for tonight's game. All right. Now there's another layer to the story. In speaking with General Manager Bob Belber, who is very upset at the moment and declined to come on to do a live interview with me for, for fear of him saying something that he doesn't want to say because he's really upset, he spoke to the commissioner of the uh, National Arena League, uh, Chris Siegfried, and Chris told him that this is not true, that if Antonio Brown wants to play tonight, he could play tonight that the owner can override any of the paperwork. It's not like a player. When you're the owner, you can override it. We have not been able to speak to Antonio Brown. I have texted him. I've called him three times, and I have not seen him in the building at the moment as we close in on kickoff. So, actually, that's where we stand right now. Antonio Brown will not play in the game tonight, and we'll have more on the game and the latest on Antonio Brown coming up on News Channel 13, actually on My 4 at 9, and then on News Channel 13 Live at 11. Ash, back to you in studio. Thanks, Raj.